Some big changes for the Kalamazoo River in Allegan County. The Otsego Township Dam will soon be a thing of the past. Plans are underway to remove it and make way for kayaking and fishing. New at 6, 24 News 8's Heather Walker is talking to neighbors about what they think of the plan. The dam is unsafe and falling apart. You can see pieces of it sitting in the river. Neighbors say they're excited for the change. Sounds of rushing water will be replaced with a more tranquil flow. There's actually a beaver dam down here. But Neighbors like Paula Fenstermaker tell us they welcome the changes. I think it's wonderful. Today, Mark Mills with the Department of Natural Resources gave us a sneak peek of the plans. Yep, this is the location where the river used to roll through. So we would be standing on the river. We'd be standing on the river and soon you would be standing on the river. DNR will remove this old hydroelectric power site to restore the natural flow of the water, clean up the river and tear down the dam. There's a lot of condition issues here with chunks of concrete falling out of the end of the spillway there. We've got a big crack that's kind of creating that rooster tail. The Otsego Township Dam was built in the early 1900s and has been failing for years. Water backed up behind the dam has signs of PCBs, a dangerous contaminant. The concern is that the PCBs will accumulate in fish and then eating the fish will expose humans to, to the, the chemicals. This project will change that, making fishing, boating and kayaking safe again. We're trying to help the ecosystem recover to where it was and allow not only people to use the river like it used to be used, but also to allow the wildlife to use the habitat as well. Can't wait to get it back to what it needs to be. Lots of people excited for this, but it could be a while before the river's back open for recreational use. The project is expected to be done in three years, but it could be closer to five years until kayakers could paddle through. In Otsego Township, Heather Walker, 24-hour news day.